Hey everyone, my name is Perry. I'm an electrical and biomedical engineer and today we're going to watch Cells at Work episode 4 to see how accurate all the science and technology scenes in this anime really are. This is super cool that they're showing you different kinds of white blood cells because there are a few different kinds in the body. And the one of the key differences between the eosinophil that we see right now and the white blood cell that is actually right next to her, the one that we've seen throughout the show, is eosinophils only exist in one part of the body, and that is your um, like your stomach and your lower gastrointestinal tract. Like they only exist in high acidic level areas, as the ones I just explained, and they cannot travel. If you have eosinophils like in your lungs, for example, this is a huge problem. And the primary reason for that is because the main weapon eosinophils use to fight off uh, bacteria or viruses is poison. Like they actually release a uh, acidic poison and that something that your stomach can actually handle because your stomach is used to having a very high pH level and it doesn't actually harm you. But if your eosinophils were in your lungs releasing that poison, that, that will cause some amount of damage. Another unique thing about them is that if your eosinophil count is zero, meaning you have none of them in your entire body, it's no big deal. <laughs> like, it's one of those few things where it's like, if you just don't have any of that type of white blood cell, this doesn't actually cause any sort of alarm. Now, if you have zero neutrophils, like the zero of like that white blood cell, the guy that we've seen so far, this is a huge problem and you are probably going to die very, very soon. コウエン気球、白血球の一種、全白血球の1%未満と言われている。コウエン気球が特定の抗原に出会うと、ヒスタミンなどが放出され、アレルギー反応を引き起こすとされている。抗原気球にも免疫に関わる機能があると考えられている
Like, um, white blood cells will actually... I'm just surprised that this thing actually just ate the guy, first of all. But, okay, so, sci science. So, in reality, what actually happens is the exact opposite of what you just saw. White blood cells will undergo a process called phagocytosis, where they actually absorb and eat bacteria and viruses, and they dissolve them using their lysosomes while they're actually inside of the white blood cell. But, this is interesting. That... Okay, that just happened. I'm not sure I would say that eosinophils main functions are to get rid of parasites. I I, I can say that eosinophils have been seen to get rid of um, helminth and protozoan type parasites and I don't know if that's their main function though and also like I'm not I'm not too well versed on eosinophils anyway so I this this might be wrong like definitely fact check me but where I'm getting my information from like I'll, I'll include the links in the description below but it's from the National Library of Medicine it's where I get a lot of my information from and I don't know if they necessarily agree with what Cells at Work has just shown. From what I've read about them, eosinophils are helpful in killing parasites in their larval states, but if you get something like that that's definitely like a little bit more well developed, I think you're going to need medication or some sort of surgery to get rid of whatever parasite is inside of you. I don't believe that your body's natural immune system is enough to kill it. And I was, I'm a little bummed out because eosinophils like, I was kind of hoping she would have some sort of, like, like poison like they have in, like, the real world. But the Biden was a really, really cool addition because she did have a unique weapon. So it's not like she used, like, a, a dagger or a knife like other white blood cells use. So, like, the show did have that unique quality about specifically a cinephil. So that was really cool that they showed that. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you want to see more Cells at Work or any other anime, movie, TV show, let me know in the comments down below. Thank you all so much for watching. Stay fresh and stay golden.